Hello everybody! Uh, I realize that this video may make some of you excited, but just to let you know, it's filler. <laughs> I'm going back to New I'm going to New Mexico for the first time. Back I'm doing um, I'm back to doing archaeology again, which means I'm gone for eight to ten days at a time. Uh, I will be literally in the middle of nowhere. Um, and I'm trying to get videos done. It's Sunday night, like almost midnight right now. I'm exhausted. I didn't have time to record Transistor, which I want to finish before I start my next series. So I was looking through what I have on this computer and this hard drive and the external hard drive I have connected, and I happen to have the Star Wars Coder uh, videos that I live streamed. Um, so this is just, again, this is purely filler. I do plan on doing this series at some point. Um, but for now, I, I want to finish, I finished basically Andromeda, I'll be playing Witcher 3, uh, Blood and Wine DLC and finishing that, um, and then I want to finish Transistor, and then I'm gonna start, um, when I play Transistor and Witcher 3 at the same time, and then I want to finish, then I want to start Horizon Zero Dawn, but because I'm gonna be gone for, like, ten days, I wanted to have a couple more videos for you guys to watch, I was only able to get four Witcher 3 ones done, so these are basically filler parts that I had, um, on this hard drive and it's a really good game I have a really good time I do plan on playing this game for the channel I don't know if I've already mentioned that I'm tired um but just so you're aware it's it's filler for now so don't expect this to be like a long-running series at this moment I just wanted something for you guys to watch and it is live streamed so it's a very informal format and me stopping and talking to everybody it's very normal um, it's not like your typical, like the typical Let's Play series that I do when I'm not streaming. So this was just for fun. We were streaming, having a really good time, and it's a really good game. So I hope you guys enjoy it, and I will try to keep you updated on it if I'm ever able to play this as an actual series. But for now, I hope you enjoy. So I will see you guys when I get back from New Mexico. Okay, we're now recording for realsies. Alright, so just in case I record, I end up using this for YouTube, I want to say hello to YouTube people. This is my first time playing Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. I've played a bunch of other Bioware games, as you may know, but we're going to try this one out. And we're on stream right now, and the game looks hella different running. <laughs> oh, yes, we, we, we've been playing a different game on Twitch, and now we're going to try out Knights of the Old Republic and see how it goes. A lot of people have been recommending this game to me for a long time. So I figure, let's just go ahead and do it. Let's just do it. And I was recommended to pick the scoundrel class. <laughs> hey, YouTube, <laughs> says Ronland. Ronland says, hello, YouTube. <laughs> this is going to be a bit of a different format because I am streaming it. It won't be the same as if I just recorded this on my own. But it'll be nice to have people that can give me advice while I'm playing, too. So we have an explorer. Well, I want to be an explorer. A battle-ready fighter. Or a skillful rogue that gets by on stealth. See, I'm bad at I'm bad at stealth. I think I want to be I think I want to be an explorer. Ooh, custom character. Okay. Huh. I think I'll probably do the quick one. Strength, dexterity, constitution, intelligence, wisdom, charisma. Okay. I mean, man, we're going back. Like, this is like Dragon Age Origins level stuff. What do you think, Zanko? Tetra Ninja as a scout, okay? How do I make my face? I don't get to customize my character. I just get a preset. Tetra Ninja. Okay, you just like Star Wars stuff. You've never played this? <clears throat> Ahem, I'm choking. No, yeah. Yeah, it's the same as me, Ronlin. I've never played it, but I hear it's great. I might choose this one. Yeah, I like that other girl. Oh, wait, whoa. 
What? Was this her? No. I like her. Look at look at that sassy face she has. Look at that sassy face. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, let's go with her. I like her. Uh, what's my name? Halin Khan. Saint Tennis Malin Star Yasuko Yaslia Star. Padme Cordana. Rihanna, <laughs> Rihanna Khan. Whoa, Nabai, Nasin, Sarah, Gwendol, Tane. She looks like Cassandra. She does gotta look like Cassandra. We could call her Cast Chan. <laughs> you just pick a preset. This was before Bioware went all out with the customization. Okay, that's good. Paula, Degory, Degan, Jerry Avery. Let's call her Cass Avery. Oh no, capitalize, please. Cass Avery. Is that how she spelled it? Avery. 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 Is that how she spelled it? Cass Avery. Avery. Cass Avery. I like it. Yeah, she's gonna be a sassy character. She's gonna be sassy. Well, our dexterity is really high. That's good. Fortitude, reflex, and will. We have really good reflex. I don't these seem like average fortitude and will. Okay. Yeah, if I don't know what I'm doing, man, this is gonna be great. It's gonna be great. Ooh, excellent! I have to say I loved Rogue One, the, re the most recent movie. Freaking, I have so many feels about that movie. It's ridiculous. Ah! Ah! We're Star Wars! Ah! Excellent. I'm not gonna read this because my voice is kind of worn out. Wow, 4,000 years for the rise of government. Well, the Republic verges on collapse. This is 4,000 years ago? An invincible Sith armada. <laughs> Aaron M. Yes, we're playing. Welcome, Aaron M. We are playing Star Wars. Has left the Jedi scattered around. The Republic of the Sith's fallen in battle. Guys above the outer rim world. Man, this music is so inspiring. I'm gonna like cry. I feel like crying. This is ridiculous. Zanko, make sure I talk to every companion. Good. I will do that. I do that on the Mass Effect and I do that on the Dragon Age, but I will make sure I do it here. Rodland, I feel you on the food. I feel very rude eating this pizza, but I need to eat something. I'm gonna die. Oh no! Oh my god, one of the engines is out, I think. No! We're drifting! This is one of those ones that they use to like, uh, one of those ships that they use to like, bash the... Most, oh my gosh! Oh, am I naked? Jeez! Oh, what am I doing naked? I was going to a battle and I'm naked! She's pretty, I like her. We've been ambushed by a Sith battle fleet. The end I feel like I'm playing PlayStation 2 again. We don't have much time. Who are you? <laughs> Um, who are you? Uh, yeah, I'm left. Oh, I'm left. Tras Volgo, ensign with the Republic fleet. I'm your bunkmate here on the Endar spot. Oh, are you, buddy you boy? Too bad Lemons is not here. You haven't seen me before. Now hurry up. We have to find Bastila. 
We have to make sure she makes it off the ship alive. Who's Bastila? <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. You're right, they didn't have the, the role in the beginning of Rogue One. That's kind of strange. I did not really think about it at the time. Who's Bastila? Bastil is the commanding officer <laughs> on the Endar Spire. Well, not an officer, really. But she's the one in charge of this mission. One of our primary duties is to guarantee her survival in the event of an enemy attack. <laughs> you swore an oath just like everyone else <laughs> on this mission. I swore an oath, but I was now probably not paying attention. I heard what everyone's saying about you. You explored the farthest yeah! regions of the galaxy. You visited planets I've never even heard of. People with your skills and abilities are hard to find. It's no wonder the Republic recruited I'm you for an this explorer! Mission. But now's the time to prove yourself. I know you're a scout and not a soldier. But Bastila needs all troops at her side during this attack. <laughs> oh, they're no... You could just... You could really just be screw it all. Okay, let's go help her. Hurry up and grab your gear. You need to suit up so we can get out of here. Yeah, he's like, I've been trying really hard to stare at your boobs this whole time. Where can I get my equipment? I have. To the what am I doing here? I have no idea what I'm doing camera. here. Alternately, moving the mouse while holding down the right oh, mouse wow. button will rotate the camera as well. Wow, we're back in that era of the game verbally explaining the directions to you. Wowza. Okay. To move towards the footlocker, hold down the right mouse button and face the camera towards it. Then hold down the left mouse button as well to cause the character to run forward. What? I'm gonna die. You can left click on an object to select it. Once the footlocker is selected, left click on it again to perform the default action and open it. It's a lot of clicking. Can you repeat that? <laughs> okay. Can I? Okay, good. I can use the keyboard. Okay. Oh god, where's the footlocker? Footlocker! Do something with it. Cardio package? Cool, cool. Get all the items. Did anyone play Shadow of the Empire? Back in the days of the N64? No, I did not. Okay, 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 okay. Can I put clothes on? Are these clothes? Party inventory screen. Wow. Let me turn it down like a tad bit more. Jeez. I know, right? Actually, how old is this game? I don't actually know. Okay. Do I have clothing? Oh my gosh. Can I put some clothes on? A short sword and a blaster pistol. Ah. Clothing! Yo, can I put them on? Put them on. Okay. Freaky, what? Oh, okay, I see. Yes. Left click on a slot. Okay. Yes, do it. O okay. Put them on, it's something. I'm gonna use the blaster pistol. And the short sword. Oh, okay. Incompatible bit on the other hand. Okay. I I think I did play the Force Unleashed. I played on the PS2. Click on the pistol at the top right hand side. Okay, Whoa. let's move out. We should oh. stick together. You'll have more success with the party than on your own. Yeah. Okay. Yep, okay. Okie dokie. Basic, basic Bioware, okay. Because of the attack, this room is in lockdown. But don't worry, I've got the override How'd you get in? You'll have oh, okay. to use me to unlock the door. Okay! Okay! You always control the oh. leader of the party. You can switch who is okay. left click my portrait, left click okay. the target. The okay, left click your portrait. Door. Now that the door is open, you better take the lead again. <laughs> Zanko, you're gonna be like, you're gonna be like banging your head against the screen. I can already see it. Switching Cass Avery back to the yes. 
I'm back to the- I'm the leader again. I am the leader! You, yes, I can also- yeah, I, I figured- This is Carthel Nassi. Hey, stick. you're our attractive! You're attractive! We can't hold out long against their firepower. All hands to the bridge! That was Karth contacting us on our portable communicators. He's one of the Republic's best pilots. He's, he's gonna live then. The best pilots the always the live. Our Spire's crew put together. If he says things are bad, you better believe it. We have to get to the bridge to help defend Bastila. There's a map of the Endar Oh, this is totally PS2 era. message in your electronic journal, just in case we get separated. Oh, okay. How do I do, uh, how do I use it? You can it? access your journal, map, and other important... You can okay. use the mouse to switch between the menus. Okay. Yay. This is so... I'm like, ah, we gotta go, we gotta go! <laughs> oh, look at me, I look like a little smuggler. I love it, I look great. What? Can you do anything? Nope, you just beat. Okay. That door is locked. Ah! Okay. Come on, dude. Come be my key. What? 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 Why can't you? What? All right. Never mind. What? Let me try to do it again. I was I was not paying attention. Shoot. How do I unlock? I thought he said he was gonna have to do it. No. Press the pause button. Is that just like... Yeah, okay, okay. I, I've heard you can be legit evil in this. You can be, you can be evil. You can be, you can bring like the Sith. Oh, okay, press that, okay, okay, okay. Sorry, sorry Zanko. Well, you tried, guy. This Sith must be the advanced boarding party for the Republic. For the Republic, oh. the game pauses when you sign an enemy. When the selection ridicule shows up in red. Okie dokie. Uh. Yeah. What? Well, uh, smack him. Oh. I never spot an enemy. Left click the selected enemy once enter combat mode. This will lock the camera and you just have to target. Okay. Chances of being hit by. Do I have to do tactics all of this? Your chances of hitting a target are controlled by your statistics and behind the scenes combat rolls. Character is not affected by your aim. Combat is not affected by your aim. Your character's movement. Oh, okay. Uh, that one. Hit that one. Hit that one now. Am I hitting him? Okay, I think I, got I was. A feeling that won't be our last battle with a Sith. Good thing we have med packs to heal our wounds. It might be a good idea to use one now before our next battle. To use How an do item I do like that? <laughs> or self-targeting item of power. You'll need. Okay. Tell me about the action menu. The oh my right gosh. The screen, you'll see a list of icons. This is your action. Let's okay. click the icon you want to use to activate that power or item. Clicking on the arrows above and below the icon will cycle to other powers or item. The first icon of the action menu is for friendly, friendly force, force powers. powers. The, set, the third icon is for miscellaneous items, such as stimulants and energy shields. Oh my gosh. So how do first, I use it? Left click on their portrait to take control of the injured character. Use the mouse to look through the medical items in the action menu. Notice the up and down arrows on this icon. Okay. Use the mouse wheel. Just remember that... Okay, okay, that's fine. Let's just, okay. None of us need a med pack, so I'm not gonna worry about it. Oh boy. Anything, I don't see anything over there. Ah! Uh, yes. Whoa. Okay. No, don't run towards him, you idiot. Oh my gosh, I'm trying to run away. Oh, he's got a sword! Is he gonna die? I'm gonna die. Disengage. Oh, he died. Okay, I was gonna pull out my sword, but apparently I don't have to. I can't loot the bodies? Med pack. Remains. Remains. What remains? I saw remains. Remains. Uh, taking the items. Thank you. Switch to a sword. 
Should I switch to a sword? Just anyway? I guess he has a blaster. So let's switch to the sword. Let me try it out. Oh, wait. Um... Right there. Nope, that's not. Mmm, that's not what I wanted to do. Which one is a little. Oh, right, here. Okay, right there. Okay. Yay, I got my sword! That's cool, I got a sword! Med pack and credits. Thank you. Foot locker. Always loot. Oh, I got a long sword and a short sword. Thank you. Oh wait, another foot locker? Whoa, what? Oh, okay. It's just still beeping at me. I'm gonna Oh. I was gonna go get him, but the Sith are shiny. Wow, he's good at that. The jumpy attack. Am I deflecting with my sword? Uh oh. So you start out with a out without a lightsaber. Yeah, yeah, you don't have a lightsaber right off the bat. Okay, this 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 pause thing is a bit weird. Take too long. I know. I feel bad. I'm sorry. It's like it's like a 30 second delay between what you guys type and what and when I see it. How do you equip a grenade? I will. I will wait. If you want to tell me how to equip a grenade, I will wait. A combat suit. Put it. Put it. Put it on me. Oh, dang it, I can't do it. Figures, right? I can only throw a grenade when I'm in combat, but I am in combat! What button do I press? G? Okay, oh my gosh. Enough with the... Why won't she move? I'm really just trying to move here, and it's just not working. Yeah, I realize I don't actually want to press on any of those. Okay. Nope, go ahead, I guess. Combat mode engaged. Go ahead. What the heck? Okay. Select the enemy and pick the grenade option. I see. Okay, I will do that next time. There's a large group of enemies in my face. Credits. You've only seen, you've only seen a sword in the Emperor's Elite Guard. Yeah, that's kind of a, it seems like a sword isn't really a popular weapon in the Star Wars universe until you get to here. Advanced repair kit. I think I hear a lightsaber. Oh, I think I hear a lightsaber. All right, and I want to switch my clothing. Yes, perfect. Oh, look at us, we're so sassy. Look at the way we stand. Yeah, 
That's a dark Jedi. Oh, I knew it. Too much for us. We better stay back. All we do is get in the way. I heard Jedi. Oh, she kicking him in the face. Kick him again. Kick him again. Oh, nice. Oh. That was one of the Jedi accompanying Bastila. How did she Damn, die? She used her help. Did she get blown up with a grenade? That's stupid. Okay. Okay. Grenade. Grenade! Hello. Hello. Oh, thank you. Hit him. Hit him. I missed him. Hit again. This, like, it really takes a while for me to hit people. Jeez. Uh, thank you. Vibration cell. How nice. Bring the sass. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna be, we're gonna be sass. We're gonna be so sassy. It's gonna be ridiculous. I'm looking forward to it. I don't usually, I usually play pretty neutral characters right off the bat, but man, let's just go all out. You know, just making sure, just making sure I don't have to, I don't have to explore. Thing that Jedi couldn't defend herself from a stupid. I'm gonna blow up! I'm gonna blow up! Nope. Oh, sweet! I just countered him! Whoa! And we're switching! Okay, okay, interesting. Ooh, that was interesting. here on the bridge. They must have retreated to the escape pods. We better head that way, too. The Sith want Bastila alive, but once she's off the ship, there's nothing stopping them from blasting the Endar Spire into galactic dust. No! Turtle entry added! Wow, that's just like the guy's clothes. Thanks for the money, bro. Come on, let me move, please. Oh my gosh. What mode am I stuck in that makes it so I can't move like this? I can't, I'm like right, I'm like left clicking so hard everywhere and the key, the keys aren't working. sensitivity up a little bit please yes I what I would like to move now please oh my gosh do you want me to talk to you Basta was not here on the bridge the okay. ship went like to move now well this is switch to Trask okay okay hmm? I can level up I can level up I she won't move she refuses to move no nope, that's not something to do she refuses to move absolutely a bad place to be. Whoa! We're spiraling out of control. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. She did not. She did not. Oh. Okay, good. There we go. Okay, she blocked me in. Oh my gosh. Backpack. Another blaster pistol. Let me level up. Skill? Okay. I'm using a skill. <laughs> they are actually, they're like, they're straight out saying it that they're using a d20 roll. That's hilarious. Wow. So this is, this is, based, this is really just like a Star Wars tabletop game in video game form. Wow. Wow, um, computer use, demolition, stealth, awareness, persuade, persuade, give me persuade, oh, yes, give me persuade, <laughs> Go. 
I know. I play Bioware games. I know. Spread options. Yes. Uh huh. Yes. Okay. Persuasion. Persuasion. Feats. Okay. It doubles the critical threat range of melee attacks. The attack hits, the attack target's also stunned. Unless they make a fortitude save. This is hilarious! I actually just made... My sister and I were making a Dragon Age role-playing... Like the role-playing tabletop game. We were making a character yesterday for it. So this is hilarious that, I, that, I'm, that I'm doing this now. Strike. Extra melee attack during the round. Character suffer minus four to defense. Oh, yikes. Jeez. Persuade unlock special dialogues. Heck yeah, I always... Uh, that was the only advice I ever got for playing a Dragon Age or playing a Bioware game was to make sure you unlock any persuasion, charm, dealy wops that you can. Implant level? Oh. Scouts get this feat for free. Oh, so I, I already have these these ones outlined in green. I already have. But I... So I could get another one of these. Oh! Huh. Caution. Empathy. Gives a plus one skill bonus to persuade, awareness, and treat injury. What's awareness? That's interesting. Gearhead, repair, security, and computer use. To all saving throws. Power attack. Power blast. Yikes. I have rapid shot, okay. And I had this pistol. Oh, I could get that. Adds a plus one attack to... I only have a pistol. I don't have a rifle. Heavy weapons. Sniper? No, I'm not a sniper. Well, I, I've been enjoying it, but I'm not going to worry about it on this one. Hmm. Oh, plus one vitality point every time they level up. Oh, and it's a retroactive one, though. Very focus on sing using single one-handed weapons in battle. Hmm. At this, looks like I should maybe do it. The dueling one. Oh, or as a... Plus one attack with what melee weapons. Single one-handed weapons. Do I have the force choke yet? Uh, I, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking that's not an option just yet. <laughs> but I certainly hope to get it at some point. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I, I'm gonna go with the basic one for now. I think. Not like any of the weapons ones. Repair, security. I'm trying to kind of think like as a scout what what I would what I would want. I have I can't get the next implant level. Become a Sith. Ah, I don't know, man. That'd be cool. I think I'll get I'll get the persuasion one for right now. The empathy. I guess empathy wouldn't be a Sith, would it? Repair, security, and computer use, though, could be useful, but... I'm gonna get this one because it has the plus one to persuade. Oh, what's the recommended one? Oh, two, two weapon fighting? Okay. I might act... I was looking at that one because if I could... I don't know if I can still wield... I don't think I can wield a pistol and a sword in the same hand... In, in two different hands. 
But dual weapon fighting would be cool. Maybe a short sword and a long sword? I don't know. We'll get it. Accept. Yay! Look, it shows my modifiers there and everything. How awesome. Okie dokie. You can have romances in this, right? That's, that's the important part. Who am I gonna romance? Where did he say we should go? Let's check, uh... Nope, uh... Messages. Okay. Where do I go? Where's the escape pods? Ah! Okay, just go back down to the left. Yes, I can have romances! Yes! Who am I gonna romance? Oh god dang. Um you do this. Okay, move Cass. You're in the way. Oh my good god. I'm stuck on Cass. Oh my gosh. Come over here. Why can't I not I don't see the locky thing? Is there a way around? I don't think that's a way to go. Go back to the bridge? To the bridge! Oh, is there a key? There's probably a key or something. is exploding! Door! Door! There's another door! Okay, beat me again. How many med packs do I have? Here. Have a med pack. And, oh no, I don't care. What? Oh, it uses it on everybody. Oh, okay. There we go. Something I'm just stuck. I'm just stuck at the door. Damn, another Dark Jedi. I'll try to hold him off. You get to the escape pods. Go! What? Why me? What are you doing? You don't know what you're doing? Guy! Oh my gosh. He went in there with a sword. Oh my gosh. Guy! I thought we were gonna be friends. Should I go to the starboard section? I hope, I hope that's where I'm supposed to go. This is Carthel Nassi on your personal You're attractive! I'm tracking your position through the Endar Spire's life support systems. Basilis escape pod is away. You're the last surviving crew member on the Endar Spire. Oh, okay. So I can't wait for you much longer. You have to get to the escape pods. So basically me running around was useless. He's just a tutorial companion. Poor Trask. Did I just... Oh good, it went through the wall. Excellent. I was worried. Nope. Yeah. Is this a critical strike? Yeah. I just critical striked you. I'm pretty sure. Oh no. Okay, put the weapon away. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. But it. No oh, go. No. Oh crap. Take off my sword or something. I don't know. Uh, no. None. Put none in there. No, no, yes. None. Okay. Oh my gosh. Why are we stuck? Okay. Yeah, I just kamikaze him, but now she's stuck. I need to look this up. Keep getting stuck after the. No, wait, not not two. Just the first one.
simply... Hmm. It says maybe you can be revolve a couple times? I don't know. No? Pan, camera, left. It's... This game really doesn't like me. It doesn't. Which doesn't work. I'm reading this on, on a discussion forum on Steam. You changed your V-Sync settings. Let me see. Where are my V-Sync settings? Oh god. Graphics? Basic? Nope. Oh, there we go. Okay, that worked. Excellent. That's good. That was gonna be a pain in the butt. Pain in the butt. Yeah, Zanko, do you know when this place placed in relation to the movie? It said it was 4,000 years before... Oh crap, now am I stuck or something? There's not many places for me to go. Sounds like horrible things are happening in there. Ah! This takes place long before the movies. Yeah, it was like 4,000 years or something. Like, if, if I was reading that right in relation to what was going on. This door? I'm gonna go through this door. Oh, hi! Have a grenade. Oh. Yeah, you died. You died. I'm dodging. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, man. Oh, look at that! That's pretty cool. That's pretty snazzy. Look at that! That's pretty fancy. Be careful. Ha ha! A squad of Sith troopers on the other side of that door. You need to find some way to thin their numbers. I think you I just could reprogram the damaged assault droid to help you if you have enough repair parts. Or you could use computer spikes to slice into the terminal and use the Endar Spire security systems against the Sith. Ha ha ha! Ha ha! I don't know. Everybody in the future has some sort of tech knowledge that I do not have in real life. Like, it just seems like everybody knows something about everything. Before the Mandalorian? After the Mandalorian Wars. Okay. Okay, how about I... I'm gonna try this one. This one sounds better. Oh, boy. Players can slice into computers to try to override... Slicing a computer requires computer spikes. I have some of those, it looks like. The moral number, blah, 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 blah. Press cancel, press enter. Okay. Oh. Computer overload power conduit. Okay. Yeah? Blow up now. Thank you! That was just, that was fantastic. Logging you out. Okay, good. That was much simpler than having to fight them. Remains, they're all been electrocuted. Dang, I am vicious. I got a frag grenade. I got a frag grenade. Ooh, that's a, that's a, that's a, like an elite guard. Ion blaster and prototype vibro blade. <gasps> gimme, gimme. Med pack. Yeah, so they. Well, I mean, like, it's it's amazing to me that Star Wars, everything is basically still like you can go four thousand years in the past of Star Wars, and everything is still this advanced. Like we still have space travel and stuff. That's pretty crazy to me. But nothing really seems to change. Not that you can blame it, but... Yes, I... that... 
Okay. So this is like a... That's like, no, not really, but it's kind of maybe sort of like a lightsaber. You've made it just in time. There's only Hello, one future husband. <laughs> Come on, we can hide out on the planet. <laughs> the society is very stagnant, yes. <laughs> How do I know I can trust you? I'm a soldier with Republic. Like you. It's Caden! Crew members left on the end of our It's Caden's voice! The pod's already gone, so there's no reason for us to stick around here and get shot by the Sith. Now, come on. There'll be time for questions later. It's Caden's voice! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! I, I was like, why do I trust this boy? I, I was like, I was like, automatically, I was like, I love, I'm already in love. Like, what is this? Like, oh my gosh, like, I already trust and respect him. And I just realized it's because he has Caden's voice! Oh. Karth. Okay, Karth, what now? Karth, oh god, am I stuck? I'm stuck on you, babe, oh boy. Okay, here we go. Escape pod. This is the last escape pod and your only hope of survival. Amen. Step away from the escape pod. Uh, no, use the escape pod, thank you. Do I play Mass Effect, Eren? Yes, I do. I play loads of Mass Effect. I love it. I love it to bits. I romanced Caden. Well, the first time I played, I romanced Liara, because I played a male shepherd. Romance Liara, and then I romance Tally, and then I stopped playing because I wanted to play a female shepherd so I could romance Thane in Mass Effect 2, and I romance Caden in Mass Effect 1 with my female shepherd, and her name is Raven, and I love her to bits. I love Mass Effect. It's my first Bioware game. Sith battle! Or Jedi bat was that me or is that somebody else? Like was that a dream? I think that was a dream. You've completed them 22 times, Aaron. I applaud I'm silently applauding you. Like, wow. I've only completed them three times each. Good to see you up instead of thrashing about in your sleep. You must have been having one hell of a nightmare. I, I wish I had one played that many times. I'm Karth, one of the Republic soldiers from the Endar Spire. Was with you in the There's so many routes to take in those games, you know? There's so many different ways to play them. So many different ways to play those games, and I just... I want to I do them all. I want to do all the romances, everything. All of them. Karth is romanceable, says Zanko! Woo-hoo! Woo-hoo! <laughs> Good, because he has Caden's voice, so I'm automatically plus, plus ten to him. <laughs> all right. Uh, Karth, the one with the communicator, I remember. Um, so we're gonna be sassy. Right, I'm Cass Aviary, by the way. How did we get here? Something in out of consciousness for a couple of days now, so I imagine you're pretty confused about things. But try not to worry. We're safe. At least. Yeah, where are we exactly? We're in an abandoned apartment on the planet of Terrace. We were banged up pretty bad when our escape pod crashed, but luckily I wasn't seriously hurt. Oh, how nice! We drag you away from the crash site and all the confusion, and I stumbled into this abandoned apartment. By the time the Sith arrived in the scene, We're basically living together. Oh my gosh. Oh, Aaron, I can't wait for Mass Effect Andromeda. Mean either. Oh my gosh. Like, yeah, like, I'm like, the fact that it's this year, like, I remember in December being like, holy crap, it's only four months until they release, until it's going to be out. Because we all had an idea that it was going to be a releasing at the end of March. And I just, Ugh! and I've been watching all their videos and stuff that they've put out. And I can't wait. Can't wait. It's all I'm gonna do. It's all I'm gonna play when it comes out. I'm gonna play it for like three months straight. It does. It looks so good, huh, Ron? Then, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So, are we just gonna wait around here for the Republic to rescue us? I don't know. I got yeah. Terrace is under Sith control. Their fleet is orbiting the planet. They've declared martial law and they've imposed a planet-wide quarantine. I thought I said quarry and I've been in worse spots. I saw on your service. I'm gonna like pass out. I'm not like already in love with him. Of alien languages. That's pretty rare in a raw recruit. But it should come in handy while we're stranded on the floor. I know foreign languages. Woohoo! <laughs> if we're gonna find Bastila and get off this planet, we can't rely on anybody but ourselves. All aboard the hype train! You're gonna get
get it for the PS4, Aaron? Nice. I'm gonna I'm gonna be getting it for my PC. Oh man, I can't wait. I want to pre-order it because if you if you pre-order like the deluxe edition, you get a pet pie jack. You get a pet pie jack. Like, I never know I wanted one until I saw that as an option, and I was like, oh, I have always wanted a pet pie jack. <laughs> Oh man, I am, I am. You have to be sassy to romance cart. Nice! <laughs> I'm already excited. Oh, <laughs> uh, why is it so important to find Bastila? That smack to your head did more damage than I thought. Bastila's a Jedi. She was with the strike team that killed Darth Revan, Malak's oh. Sith Master. Bastila's the key to the whole Republic war effort. The Sith must have found out that she was on the I'm dying, this is Caden. set an ambush for us in this system. I believe Bastila was on one of the escape pods that crashed out here in Terrace. For the sake of the Republic war effort, we have to try and find her. Um... How can one person, even a Jedi, be so important? <laughs> we got to be sassy to romance. I keep wanting to call him Cassian. His name is Karth, but I keep wanting to call him Cassian, and it makes me kind of want to cry a little bit inside because of that movie. Vasila is no ordinary Jedi. She has a rare gift the Jedi ah. call meditation. Vasila's power can influence entire armies. What? Through the Force, Vasila can inspire her allies with confidence and make her enemies lose their will to fight. Often, that's all it takes to tip the balance in a battle. Of course, there are limits to what she can Miss do. Miss From what I understand of her ability, it requires great concentration and focus to maintain her battle meditation. The attack on the Endar Spire happened so fast, she never had a chance to use her battle meditation. In such a stressful like environment, us, she yeah. Got out she would need to be away from the battle a little bit. Miss Sassalot. That's what we're going to call her now. Miss Sassalot. So... How do you even know she's still alive? I don't. But Vassal is young, and she has a powerful command of the force. I'm already jealous. I'm already jealous. Thing, so I'm willing to bet that she may have. Nope, too. nope, you're mine. Alternative. I mean, if she's dead, <laughs> no one can stop Malik and his Sith from wiping out the Republic, and I'd rather operate on the assumption that she survived. Interesting. So the most important character in this, the one with like the predestined ability to save the galaxy, isn't me. I like that. I like game like Dragon Age 2, where like you weren't really an important figure in the overall grand scheme of things. You were kind of a side character, and you got to play from the point of view of somebody who could only affect the 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 the, the people around them. Basically, you had no control over the wider galaxy. So this is interesting. This is really interesting. How can... Oh no, we already did that. If, okay, so what do you suggest we do next? Vassal's gonna need our help. Many of Darth Malak's followers can use the dark side of the Force, and the Sith have already killed more than their share of The Jedi Jedi's. always get killed off Nobody faster than the Sith do. a couple of common soldiers like us, and if we're careful, we can move about the planet without attracting notice. A luxury Vassal won't have. She's gonna have half the Sith fleet looking for her. They know how important she is to the war effort. The whole planet is under quarantine. No ships can land or take off. So if Basil's gonna escape Terrace, she's gonna need our help. And we'll probably need hers. Hmm. Miss Sasselot like in Oblivion? Is there a character? There's not a character named Miss Sasselot in Oblivion, is there? My gosh, that would be hilarious. Any idea where we should start looking? I don't think... I'm not a scoundrel. I'm a scout. I'm an explorer. So I'm not, like, opportunistic exactly. Oh, uh, any idea where we should start looking for her? While you were out, I did some scouting around. There are reports of a couple of skate pods crashing down into the Undercity. It's probably a good place to start. But the Undercity's a dangerous place. We don't want to go there unprepared. And it won't do Basil any good if we go and get ourselves killed. What happened to the rest of the ship, of the people in the ship? Okay, I want to ask you some questions. I'll tell you whatever I can, though I'm, I don't know how much help. Maybe I'm gonna maybe turn down the music a little bit once I like like as compared to the dialogue in a second. Um, what do you know about Malik and the Sith? Everything I know about Malik is pretty much common knowledge. He escaped the trap that killed Darth Revan, his Sith master. With Revan's death, Malik became the new Dark Lord. It's obvious that Malik's a ruthless His hair moves a little bit. Anyone who stands in his way, just like Revan was. 
Experience has shown that the Sith won't stop until the Republic lies in ruins. We can never... Malik and his Sith don't respect anything except raw, brutal power. It's hard to imagine how someone who used to be a Jedi could become such a monster. <laughs> yeah, I see her nodding. She's like, yeah. <laughs> a Jedi? What do you mean? Malak and Revan were once both part of the Jedi Order, but they were young and headstrong. And against the wishes of the Council, they went to battle the Mandalorians. Hey, look, Ronland! Something happened out there. Something corrupted the them and drew them over to the dark side. Or maybe there was something rotten inside them all along. I don't know. They formed an army of ex-Republic soldiers and... Oh, Jedi like in Oblivion. Oh, okay, I see what you're With saying. Revan yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Until Revan was killed by Vassila's Jedi strike team. But even that didn't slow the Sith down. Malak just stepped in and assumed Revan's role. He took control of the Sith Armada and resumed the bloody conquest of the Outer Worlds. Aren't you actually a Sith the whole time? Like, like as a Jedi? Like, you're, you're not actually a Jedi, but like you're basically born as a Sith? I was, I know that there are some, I'm, I don't know a whole lot, I don't know enough about Star Wars to definitively talk on this sort of a thing, but I know that sometimes Sith, or like Darth, like, like Darth, like Darth Vader, obviously, he was a Jedi once, but he switched over to the dark side, but I feel like, I was about, I was actually curious, I was about to say, if they are just brought up that way, and not, not, you, they're usually brought up to be Dark Lord Sith people, and not usually Jedi, but, I don't know. What? Sounds like Malak and the Sith have the right idea. What? No! Uh, don't worry, we'll find a way to stop the Sith. I hope you're right. But the Republic hasn't been able to stop them so far, even with their support of the Jedi Council. I think Basila may be the galaxy's last hope. Interesting. What can you tell me about the planet we're on? Taurus was once a magnificent planet-wide metropolis. Taurus I love his voice! Ah! The upper city where the rich citizens live is, is still pretty safe. If it wasn't for the Sith occupation and the planet-wide quarantine, it might not even be a bad place to live. But farther down, things have degenerated. The, the lower city is nothing but a slum overrun by swoop bike gangs, waging a never-ending war. Swoop bike gangs? And Swooping is bad. Is, even worse. The lowest level of terrace is a wasteland overrun by raccoons. Raccoons? Disease, new Yikes! I've already entered all this info into your data badge. Thank you for reading my journal! He read my journal? What a jerk. I'd like to know some more about you, Karth. <laughs> this is such a bad time for this. Yeah. I understand why you want to know more about me. I, I kind of get the feeling we'll be spending a lot of time. Oh, God. Wow! But this isn't really the best time for long Wow. We should stay focused on the task at hand. There'll be a time for that later. Am I a Sith the whole time in this game? I have no idea. I've never played this game before. Okay, this one we start looking for her. Oh, Good fire. idea. Yay. We can use this abandoned apartment as a base. We can probably get some equipment and supplies here in the upper city. Just remember to keep a low profile. Sure, sure, There's buddy. Some stories about the Dark Jedi interrogation techniques. They said the Force can do terrible things to a mind can wipe away your memories and destroy your very identity. But I figure if we don't do anything stupid, we should be okay. I and mean, after all, they're, they're looking He keeps saying that. He keeps saying we should like be us. fine. And I get more and more worried right, the soldier, more he says it. Let's move out. Oh, talk to Karth again. Come here, Karth. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh, God, I was doing something else. Okay. Talk to me. Yes, what's on your mind? Uh, do you want to know more about you? Me? Okay, well, good. I've been a star pilot for yeah. years. I fought the Mandalorian Wars before all this. Nice. Story. Okay, so we're right after the like Mandalorian Wars. Not even the Mandalorians were that senseless. My home world was one of the first planets to fall to Malak's fleet. Aww. The Sith bombed it into submission, and there wasn't a damn thing our Republic forces could do to stop them. Oh, I'm sorry. You're talking like it's your fault, like you failed somehow. It shouldn't be my fault. I did everything I could. I followed my orders and did my duty. Wow, he's, shouldn't mean I he's failed brandishing me. his pistol at me. He's brandishing his pistol at me! Wow. 
Uh, hey, why are you getting so mad at me? Um, he wants to go to second base for sure. <laughs> not, not right now. Uh, oh shoot, this is important. How I react to this. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to upset you. Them, I, I keep on. I kind of want to probe him. Them? Do you mean the people of your home world? Um... Yeah. yeah. No, I... That's not what I mean. I mean, I, I'm sorry, I'm not making much sense, am I? You probably mean well with your questions. I'm just not accustomed to talking about my past very much. At all, actually. I'm more used to taking action, keeping my mind focused on the business at hand. Let's just do that. If you have more questions, ask them later. Okay. How do I... Is there like a... Um... um... Is there like a... Meter for what my companions think of me? <gasps> Ronland, you're working on a Mandalorian outfit! Holy buckets! Going pretty slow, though, but man, like, wow. Wow. Wow! I'm always impressed. Always. Where's, like, um... Can I switch over to him somehow or do i have to no okay i had to figure it out okay all right so they so for for dragon age which i believe was the next game dragon age origins was the next game to come out after this they switched that up a bit by letting you see it i prefer i do i i guess part of me likes the being able to see the approval but another part of me thinks it's really cool when I actually had to figure it out too. It's more organic that way. Um, wow, this music. Okay. Upgrade. Yay. Sure, let's use it. I, okay, upgrade item. 1 to 10. Versus two weapon penalty if used in the offhand. I can use it in my offhand then. Can I upgrade it? What? Oh! You're too short to be a stormtrooper. <laughs> I'd like to be one of the sand people. That'd be cool. Um. Sure. Okay. Oh, nice. I should probably put it. How do I put it away? Is there a way to put them away? Oh, did she put it? No, she didn't put it away. Let me actually. I would like to maybe equip the. I have two vibro blades. Jeez. I'd like to equip the short sword in my offhand. Is this my offhand? Am I right or left-handed? Ewok! Nice! You want to be an Ewok, little squirrel? Can you do a wheel? I better be able to do a wheel, lightsabers! That'd be awesome. If I can dual wield swords, I'm kind of assuming I can dual wield... Okay, so there's the penalty. Okay, this is the main hand. This is the off hand. Okay. Sand people, I know, Ronland, I'm bad. I'm bad at names, I'm bad. Okay, don't hate me, <laughs> don't hate me. Sand people. How do I unequip? Like, are, is there a way she could just like put it away? You want to be a Wookiee? Oh, the sand people, they scared you as a kid? They are pretty scary. A Wookiee? They are strong. I read a book. I, when I was younger, I really liked reading, like, the Young Jedi books. And there was one with this, like, girl Wookiee. And I was like, as a kid, I was like, I didn't even realize there were girl Wookiees. 
and I thought it was really cool, and they sounded um, really cool. Like, I don't know, being a Wookiee could be awesome. Like, I liked I liked reading from her perspective. Yeah. Where binge in? Uh, black blah. blah. Yeah, how do I sheathe it? Mm. You want to be a Sith? You like being evil in Mass Effect? Nice, Aaron. Oh, I guess being okay, being a Jedi would be really cool. But I mean, the more. The more I read into, like, you know, I don't know, as a kid I just read a lot of books from different perspectives, and I honestly liked the idea of being a smuggler better. And I can wear a cloak even though I'm not a Jedi. If I want to. Okay, so the, my, my character might just put him away later. Okay, I was looking it up really quick. I must select which party member to take. Look at me just stand. Look at that butt. I have a nice butt. Press X to do a twirl? Whoa. This is the first time I'm leaving. I'll have to take Karth. Okay, I have to take Karth. Okay. <laughs> right, you alien scum. Everybody, get up against the wall. This is a raid. What? <laughs> Wow! Okie dokie then! Jeez! That's how we sit deep with smart mouth aliens. Now the rest of you, get up against the wall before I lose my temper again! What's this? Humans hiding out with aliens! They're Republic fugitives! Attack! What? Oh my gosh! How did you just guess that right off the bat? Hang on. I love how many aliens are in Star Wars, like how many different alien types. Because Mass Effect, I mean, is, is fairly limited. And a lot of space games are, but Star Wars never... Star Wars was like, screw it! We're just making them up, we're throwing them in! We're gonna have so many aliens, you wouldn't even know what to do with them all. Won't someone come searching for this patrol? Oh, nice. Thank you, guy. He's gonna move the bodies for me. It almost sounds like some parts of it are attempting to be like Japanese or something. Not surprising, though. I did hit him with the grenade, that's why he's clutching his chest. No, I'm sorry, guy. Okay. Um, sorry, guy. I thought he was further back, so I thought I wouldn't hit him. Oh, my bad. I'll have to be careful. It's good to know, though, that there's not... Who are you? Are you a store guy? Are illegal aliens like ha ha ha? Wow, this is taking a little bit long, you know. Wow, you have the option to be either super sweet and nice or a complete jerk. Pleased to meet you, Lair. My name is Cass Avery. Avery, Avery. New energy shields, ho ho! Uh, what's so great about the energy shields? 
Okay, radio mash that absorbs blaster bolts pretty handy in a fight. It should even protect against lightsaber. It won't protect against lightsaber. And I can tell you from experience that they aren't any good at all against a simple vibroblade. That's why uh, the Republic has been training soldiers in hand-to-hand -hand and melee combat. Boo-boo. <laughs> yep, yeah, mm-hmm. Boo-boo. Bobo. Where did this technology come from? I guess he's care. He's wandering around with his blaster in his hand, so... Hmm. I wonder if there's chances to like explore ancient alien technologies and stuff. Wonga kumbis chang ba mulera ta kumju stak miki grabul mogo kachi kachi gratu noda pograshi oni tolpa da pongwale kando ta kumu chut chut kam. Anything else? Hotunga kud tong abongsha. Um. Why do you have a kiosk set up here? You mentioned something about illegal aliens living here? Relax. Ah, otherwise you get squatters, people hiding out from the authorities. <laughs> and they don't pay rent. Ha ha ha. Aren't you worried about getting caught? Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, let me try to sell you stuff. What? Oh, okay, there we go. Let's sell... Sell the clothing. So, well, actually, I should probably, I should probably keep some of this to hand out, right? To people, I would assume. Computer spike, parts, clothing, military suit, heavy combat suit, stun baton, quarter staff. I want a quarter staff. Ah! Can I have a quarter staff? Sanko, can I have a quarter staff? <laughs> Is that a good? It's only look. It's not as good. Ma, I want a quarter staff. Is this really a game where you could? I whoa, my my most favorite weapon in the whole world that I would love to play with is a spear. I want to play a spear. I was so sad in Skyrim. I was fully, I wanted to make like a Valkyrie. I was like, I'm going to make a spear shield maiden. It's going to be great. And then they said, nope, we don't make spears in this game. And I was so freaking sad. I was so sad. Oh, man. I don't have enough money for any of this, though. That one only cost two credits. Oh, I don't have any money. I don't have any money. Let's see. Ithorarian. Hello. Ah, okay. Residence. Low security door. Does that mean I can hack this door open with my sword? Thorian? <laughs> Hey. Ah. You're stuck here too. What's this? Nothing? Search the apartments? Can I get into the apartments? Oh, hey! Oh, you're another Twi'lek. Oh, you are another Twi'lek. Janitor. Oh, okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come With mods you can use spears? I don't want to break- I don't want to break into any of the doors, so... Hey there, what, 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 we are walking, <laughs> I just clean no floor. I just clean no floor. Uh, 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 sorry. Well, all right then, no hard <laughs> My name's Kadir, I'm the janitor for this building. You must be the new tenant here, right? Eh? Never thought they'd rent that abandoned <laughs> apartment. <laughs> you look like an off-worlder. 
How can you tell? Here because of the quarantine. I'm gonna ask you Don't some questions. Don't know how much I can tell you, but tell me about Terrace. Decent enough place to live, I guess, except for the lower levels. That's where the swoop gang swoop. hang out. Swooping Just is bad. Just city, and you'll be fine. Swooping you is bad. You also might want to check out the cantina. I used to go there when I was younger. Good place to get a drink and find out what's going on in the upper city. Okay, cantinas, right, right. Just keep following Those are very the important. apartment complex ring until you come to the elevator. Ah, okay. It'll take you out to the upper streets there, then. and from okay. there, don't know. Uh, right. Not much of an issue for me, you know. I ain't never left. I prefer to keep to myself mostly. Ah, okay. I should get back to work anyway. I'll probably. See <laughs> no sass, you walk where you want. No, I don't want to be a jerk. <laughs> Did you just bow or are you like cleaning or something? I don't know, I can't tell. Uh, well, I'm going to call the recording here really quick. I'm going to keep playing, but I do, I'm going to call the recording here super quick. So, for those who watch this on YouTube eventually, I hope you're enjoying it. Let me know what you think, and I'll still see you.